Hi, my name is Virginia Tyson. I'm in my seventh year teaching at Pierce County High School in Blackshear, Georgia. I teach physical science and I've always loved using technology to engage students in scientific inquiry and higher order thinking. I received my undergraduate degree from the University of Georgia in science education in 2014, and I received my master's degree from Georgia Southern University in the spring of 19, also in science education. I started at Kennesaw State in the hopes of receiving my specialist degree in instructional technology. I began this program a year and a half ago, and I learned so much in the process and am excited to graduate and use these tools this fall. One of my most main accomplishments in this program has been my capstone completion. This was my first experience acting as a technology coach. I was able to address a need in my school and work with teachers by designing professional learning opportunities to meet their individual needs. Some of the sessions I held were whole group, while others allowed me to work one on one with teachers as they work to become competent in using technology to assess students, analyze data and modify their instruction to meet the needs of their individual students. Another major accomplishment was when I completed my current reality SWOT and action evaluation plan for my school. This really helped me to see firsthand how technology personnel and administration at my school think about technology. It also helped me to gain insight into the practices carried out by instructional technology coaches on a day-to-day -day basis. One of the most meaningful field experiences that I had in this program was the assistive technology project. I had a deaf, hard of hearing student in my class and he was a senior and had not been performing well throughout his entire time in K-12 education. Using research, about new digital programs, I was able to have my content sent to a hearing aid and also use new digital tools in the classroom, such as a mic that connected to his hearing aid so that he could hear me better. This showed me the importance of using technology to assist students at a young age so they don't fall through the cracks and perform poorly. Being able to hear better allowed him to access the content equally with his other peers. A school should utilize me as a technology facilitator because I am always driven to find the most efficient and engaging tools for students and teachers. If we want to increase Lodi in the classroom, we have to be using technology that encourages collaboration between students and higher order thinking. Throughout the completion of this program, I have learned valuable skills that have helped me to increase Lodi and therefore increase student achievement. During the class, Requiring me to act as a data coach, I learned how to assess current data and find ways to improve student learning through the incorporation of new strategies and incorporating technologies. I also learned the practical ways that technology facilitators assess current situations regarding technology using SWOT analysis and developing an action evaluation plan. My short term goal is to use the skills as a technology coach to find new ways to engage my students in science learning that requires them to use digital tools and critical thinking skills. I will use many of the tools and skills that were presented in this program to find research-based strategies for improving student learning in my classroom. Long-term, my goal is to become an instructional technology coach. After completing my capstone, I saw just how necessary instructional technology coaches are. With all of the duties that are placed on classroom teachers, they need assistance when it comes to finding digital tools that would be most useful in the classroom and learning how to use those tools most effectively and efficiently as an instructional technology coach, I hope to spend my time finding the best ways to assist teachers as they work to include digital resources in their classroom. I have always seen the need for an instructional technology coach, and now I have the tools and the skills for that to be that help for teachers around me.